this is really a celebration of what it means to be connected and to come here together and learn together and, and have a lot of conversations. Rochelle Gribble and I am the curator of the Atmospheres Deep exhibition representing Super Collider, the gallery space that I founded that merges art, science and technology. So we were very excited to be able to partner with the San Luis Obispo Museum of Art to tell the story of the oceans and the local ecosystem of this area. So myself and our guest curator, Emma, was able to team up to be able to share what it means to explore our oceans at every level, going atmospheres deep. So as visitors attend this exhibition, we are really hoping that they travel through the layers of the ocean as they come through. So as you enter into the museum, you'll see a lot of works that are focusing on the surface of the water. And as you navigate through the gallery, you end up going level by level through the shoreline, which is oftentimes covered with plastic pollution, to coral ecosystems and seeing what is human impact in that area. And then later you descend into the deeper depths of the ocean. And our design for this curation was really focused on increasing our atmospheric pressure as you go deeper, but drawing that comparison of social pressures that we're being faced with as our oceans are changing. It's been a really rewarding experience. This show has come together in a beautiful way. Um, it, it exceeds the imagination in the sense that we have been coordinating each week and thinking about how to place this show together and to go into the stratified layers that Rochelle mentioned, walking from the surface tension and submerging into the subtidal zone and ending in the deep sea and speculating these entanglements um, between biocultures and human cultures um, in this need to act and preserve and protect um, what keeps us together. And so this collaboration, we came, Rochelle and I, from Super Collider Gallery with this passion for the ocean, with this drive to bring together art and science and communication. And Courtney and Leanne and everyone from the Slower Museum has kind of cemented and, and bonded what Rochelle and I have, have created here. I'm hoping that everybody that walks into the exhibit has a different experience. Some people might be really driven and knowledgeable in technology. Other people might be uh, really well versed in painting or hand weaving and the subject matter, right? So some people um, might have this connection to the surface of the water and its meditative qualities. Some people might think, oh, this is my favorite fish that's on camera here. Um, or others might find the tactile qualities really intriguing, like our water tanks or our, our woven pieces, um, especially the crochet coral reef. So we're very excited to be presenting this exhibition to all of you. We hope that you will come and interact and be submerged in all of these artworks. And I hope that you can, can leave this exhibition thinking a little differently about the sea and how we can you know, decrease our pressure <laughs> with the weight of our impact to really make a change in the world.